What's up, family? It's Too Cool TB, representing Power by Vibes, and we are back for 2022 to begin this year's edition of Artist Discovery. For 2022, we're going to have 50 songs. We're starting in February, just like how I did back last year, started it in February. And by the math, it gives us 48 weeks of the year. Just like last year, for the last few weeks of the year, we're going to double it up and do two songs per week. So we're going to kick it off for 2022 through the month of February. We're going to do some revisits. We'll go back and listen to some newer songs for some uh, artists that I reviewed before that I like. And it's just some different songs to get a different flavor of some of my um, favorite artists from last year. So I'm going to start off with a group from the UK. That was showing me massive love and uh, the, the Hanging Bandits. And we're going to check out a new song that they call. This is called The Boxer Waits His Turn. So last year I reviewed the song The Suburban Ghost. <clears throat> I like that song a lot. And this one is going to give us a different flavor. This is a, a little bit slightly newer music video. So without any further ado, let's check it out. The only last thing I'll say this is a... It's going to take longer to get into the video. I'm, I'm a little bit under the weather still. I've been sick for a while. So I apologize for being late getting this started in uh, this month. But um, it's an excuse me coughing and clearing my throat throughout the video. That's the reason why I'm okay. I don't have that thing. I just have a regular cold. But that's, I just wanted to give you guys an explanation why I might be doing some uh, clearing my throat and coughing throughout the video. But I'm okay. So... Now they further ado is check out the hanging bandits. The boxer waits his turn. Hold on, I might have messed up my screen. Hold on. Alright. This is the intro, just in case you guys didn't know that. This isn't the song, yeah, this is the intro. He watches from a bay window overlooking your city streets. I thought this was a really, really amazing music video, by the way, guys. I'm really impressed by it. I'm <coughs> sorry about that, Bowsley. Part of the reason why I was kind of late with these, because usually I do these during the week, not the weekend. I actually recorded these videos before, but I redid them because the first time was just trash. So I had to, I had to do it over. <clears throat> You'll say that because... If I seem a little bit more well spoken and well thought out during the review section of it after the song plays, that's why I not I didn't get any smarter since last year. I just I've seen these and said everything I'm about to be saying in this video before. I thought it was interesting knowing these guys are the UK that the little kids are playing with guns. <laughs> Footsteps reach his ears and the motorways relentless <coughs> Where ring fills up the atmosphere There are no horizons, just orange boys on a black ocean This video was pretty fun From one island to the next When I did a couple weeks ago when I happened upon this song I read through the lyrics and thought about it So I like the lyrics of this song too These guys' lyrical style is very interesting too. How it's they're they're very like descriptive, you know. They they do a good job with like imagery and scenery, and I like that about their lyricism. As far as like this song goes, like the production of it and the lyricism, I can talk about a bit as we're watching it. It's cool how with this one, this is pretty simple. Like you'll notice, there's really no percussion in this song. But just kind of real simple, and it's not like a, it does have somewhat of a very ominous 
sound to it in my opinion. I like this part too. This part was pretty cool. This was pretty accurate actually. This uh, <laughs> I have a new feature for this for 2022. Are ready for this new feature? I will just point something out that I thought was cool when I had seen this. So something to notice when they have the guide squad here. The internet was freaking out. Sorry about that. But I circled that pamphlet they gave him there. That God is retribution. I thought that was a very interesting illusion here. Because now, what's kind of cool here. Let's check out what's about to happen to this character. Who I assume that this character on the um, video. This is the boxer, I'm assuming. That's, that's, that's in reference in the lyricism. So... Let's see what's about to happen to him next on the video. I thought that was a cool thing with that said that God is retribution. And they're seeing what's going to happen to him on the next scene. There's a dull glow over the Thames tonight. The clouds sang low choke the lights. No stars, but this castle is So these guys right here, they're the gangsters, I guess. He keeps waiting. The gangsters are coming. I mean, the gunshot sound was kind of weak. They could have used a little bit more powerful gunshot sound, but other than that, that was pretty cool. <coughs> Boxer, the delivery man, the youths, the guy squad, the hitman. The boxer had mob tie. Was it like uh, Pulp Fiction? He was connected. So this is the credits right here, as you can see. Just in case you didn't know that that was the credits, I want to make sure you guys knew that was the credits. <laughs> My sense of humor has not improved from 2021 either. I'm still just as annoying and irritating. Sorry about that, guys. I annoy myself when I'm watching these back because I'm like, really? Is that really the best jokes that you can come up with? It's not even funny. Anyway, shout out to the Handy Bandits, guys. I like this song. So, first section of the video, I'm going to give you my thoughts. I'm going to break down the song. So for the breakdowns, I was kind of touching on as it went through. I thought it was really interesting how in the, the arrangement of the song, there really is no percussion. I thought that was really interesting how they did that. It's kind of like a folk music type of a sound, at least to the American ear and words that we would put it in. It's like a folk music kind of sound with like just it has like the guitar sound, the bass sound, you know, it just has that going on. <laughs> like the little vocals and that's carrying the whole song but it's interesting how the way that they filled that out it filled out the entire track like i really didn't hear any like <clears throat> i didn't hear there was no chasms created sonically like there wasn't i wasn't wanting for anything more in the way that it sounded like i didn't say man this part really needs some of this it needs some of this i thought it sounded great i think that it's a very ominous tone it's how the song sounds as well, which is really cool. And I think that the vocal performance here was excellent. The way how it was kind of delivered in a more ominous way. They kind of went with that. As I touched on too, the lyrics of this is really cool. Because I felt that it's very poetic sounding to me. And it's, it is very cool how it's, it's kind of painting the picture. You know, he's looking out the window. This is what he's seeing. This is what's going on tonight. And... Mixed in with that, he's it's, it's giving a little bit of social commentary, you know, like to talk about the money, but at least he effing spends it, you know. I guess I like this song a lot, guys. I think you guys did a great job on this one, so that's what my reaction to it is. I think it's absolutely amazing work. As I was impressed to the first song, I'm even more impressed on this one. This one's even better, so I can't wait to hear what else that you guys do. You know, I really like. You guys work, and I think you guys are doing an amazing job. And um, 
Yeah, I mean, hopefully, maybe our paths can cross in a way that I can see you guys live. I definitely would love to come out and support. You know, I don't know, maybe if I if I may if I manage to get across the pond whenever the pandemic is over. I actually have some family members that's going over um, to Europe. And they're in the military, so I definitely hope to you know, visit them, of course, while they're over there. So maybe that'll be an opportunity for me to get across the pond and uh, check you guys out. You never know. Maybe you guys might find your way in America somewhere. And I'll get uh, be somewhere on the East Coast. I'd love to come and check you guys out. You never know. So with all that being said, the critique section of the review. I don't really have any critiques at all because this is why, in, in my opinion, if I was someone producing this song, I would change nothing. I think you guys nailed it. Everything came off very good. Execution was pretty much perfect for what I perceive you guys as trying to do with this song. So I think this is an amazing track. Everybody go check out The Hanging Bandits. Go support their stuff. You know, I love seeing them. Um, give feedback to the you know the powered by vibes project and what we are doing me and the atom bomb who you guys haven't seen on camera yet i'm trying to get him on camera in 2022 for sure and we're trying to find a couple more people to help out as well with writing articles for the site and producing some videos and whatnot so yeah shout out to the hanging bandits and now it's time to go to everyone's favorite part we're gonna see where it rates the 2022 edition of the powered by vibes bill Board chart. Let's see where I put you guys at. So the chart's kind of boring right now because it's just four songs on it right now for the month of February. So let's go to the chart. I don't got to do nothing because this is already filled out. Like I said, I filmed these videos already. This is the redo now that I'm feeling a little better. So like I cough every five minutes instead of every five seconds. But um, Hanging Bandits, Boxer Wastes Turn is number one on the Bill Board chart. To start off 2022 amazing work great guys like i really enjoy what you guys are doing i can't wait to hear some more and um you never gonna have to reach out to you guys too because i because i like what you're doing so much so we're following you just know that you got at least one fan over here in new york and um we're gonna try to spread the word about you on our website and whatnot so shout out to the hanging bandits so let's wrap this video up we're trying to keep them a little shorter for this year Got some great content for you in 2022. You're going to see some more of me doing more reactions like this. I got some more content coming out actually this weekend as this is going up. Because I'm entering a songwriting contest. So look out for that video and see. Um, check that out. You guys could actually hear me. I'm talking all this about you guys' music and, and giving critiques. Now you guys are going to get to see me actually make a song. and You guys could critique me. And uh, got some other content with the Atom Bomb. He runs the Questions for Science YouTube channel. Go check that out. He actually has a pretty viral video of what happens when you overeat. He's a science guy. He went to college for all that stuff and is really smart. So we're, we're going to do some more content together. And we're going to merge the science and the art and kind of get the science of music. So we got some cool videos planned for you for that. 2022. More album reviews coming to the powersback.com, of course. And also in 22, finally... The Funk Academy, my band and I'm the lead singer of, is going to finally have some stuff coming out this spring, summer-ish kind of time. So it's going like, to be like May, June-ish when that album comes out. A lot of great stuff coming up for you guys this year. So make sure you keep it locked over here. Anybody curious about me and what I do, just look up either um, on YouTube, look it up the channel for Professor T and the Funk Academy or follow me on Twitter. I'm not Twitter. <laughs> I'm on Twitter, but I never use it. On Instagram, at 2CoolTB. Follow The Power Is Back on Instagram, at The Power Is Back. Keep up with everything we're doing. And as always, check out what other local artists and DIY artists that we cover up to and support everybody. We're trying to create a community over here. So go ahead and wrap up this video now that we've reached the 15-minute mark. So to the Hanging Bandits, to everybody watching at home, love what you do. I enjoyed listening to this song, and I hope that all of you did, too. I spread nothing but peace and love to all of you, and I will see you on the next review.